What's up, y'all? Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Front Street News and Media. I'm just here to talk to y'all about the transfer portal because it's scorching hot right now. And I want to talk to y'all about the big three, the three biggest things in the transfer portal right now. Let's go. Now, guys, college basketball has took a tremendous turn, and I can't stress that enough over the past year. Last year in the transfer portal, Haley Van Lith was ranked number one before committing to LSU. This year, she dropped down to number 11, and now she's committed to TCU. The number one person in the transfer portal this year was Georgia Amor from Virginia Tech. She recently committed to Kentucky. The number five player this year in the transfer portal was Lucy Olsen from Villanova. She currently transferred to Iowa and will be taking the place of the late great Caitlin Clark. She is a baller, just like Haley Van Lith and Georgia Moore, but she is a shoot first point guard and has a great basketball IQ and passing and defensive ability. She'll do great in Iowa as it's a fast tempo offense and she's looking to get Iowa back to the ranks and doing great as they were over the past two years. Ranked at number four this year in the transfer portal is Charlize Leder Walker. She's probably one of the most important players in Cougar history. She is an absolute baller as well. She may be on a comeback from a minor setback as she tore her ACL back in January. She's ranked higher than two of the players, or at least one of the players that are in the transfer portal big three, in my opinion. But the only reason why her name isn't as high as or in the same category pool with the big three in the transfer portal is because when she gets to her new program, she may not be able to start right away. But we wish her a speedy recovery because she can flat out play. Now, the big three in the transfer portal. Rank that number two. Well, now number one, being that Georgia Moore has committed to Kentucky. Kiki Iriafe. Reagan Beers, and Tamia Gardner. These three are the most sought-after players in the transfer portal in women's basketball right now. Rumor has it, Kiki may want to be close to home, and she may commit to USC. Reagan Beers has a visit to the University of Oklahoma this week. No new news on Tamia Gardner and where she may land. But these three players will make an impact at at whatever program they go to. And they're going to just flat out ball. Kiki Arioffin played alongside Cameron Brink at Stanford. She had a breakout season. Maybe last year she was averaging 6.7 points per game until the most recent year. And she was averaging almost 19 alongside Cameron Brink. I want you guys to let me know down below in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. But please let me know where you think that these three will end up going. Their impact at whatever campus they end up transferring to. And their impact on the court at whatever team you think they'll be the best fit for. Thanks for watching.